PDP ready to remove APC from power in 2023, Tambowa. Hello, my wonderful people. That is the governor, the executive governor of Sokoto State. It's the PDP governor, and um, he says with all that is going on, he's very sure that PDP did much more better. And the Nigerians who are the uh, those who determine who becomes the president are ready and will stay beside or behind um, a PDP to remove APC from power. The truth about our democracy system is that there is no model of random. I mean, there is really nothing they are looking towards rather than it's my party is your party. I'll give you a little bit of uh, explanation on what I mean. Now, if P PDP and APC in Nigeria are the same, just one and the same people, you know, please go and investigate everybody in APC. They all came from, there was no neutral person. They all came from some party. So they all have their personal biases, how they think things should be done. And they bring, come with their baggages into the, into the whatever party. It's the same players, it's, the game has not changed. It's the same thing over and over and over again. So whether you like it or not, PDP, APC, in my very opinion, they are the one and the same thing, honestly speaking. They are the same people. So PDP ready to PDP ready to remove APC. Yes, APC has failed. Oh, failed bloodlandly, you know, but we need freshness. We're tired of this same old, this same old. Okay, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Subscribe if this is your first time. Let's get all the details. PDP ready to remove APC from power in 2023 Tamboa. state governors under the platform of the people democratic party pdp have pledged to provide the needed platform for the party to return to power at the federal level in 2023 chairman of the pdp governors forum and governor of sokoto state amir tabawa on saturday made a pledge at a state banquet organized by the aqua Ibom state government ahead of the forum meeting in uyu Tabuwa said that the People Democratic Party PDP governors would not disappoint Nigerians who are looking up to them to actualize their yearning for the party to return to power in 2023. Those stir shadow leaders of the People Democratic Party in their respective state and political general are determined by the grace of God through your prayers, support and cooperation to rescue Nigeria from the very present predicament we find ourselves. It is a task that we must accomplish by the grace of God and his glory alone. God on our side, we are determined as leaders to provide that platform for the emergence of another People Democratic Party leadership in this country. Come 2023, Taboa said. He urged all citizens, especially all religious leaders, to continue to pray for the country especially over the security challenges the country is experiencing. We need prayers. God is always there for his people and will never be tired for Nigerians for his glory. Taboa added, earlier in his remark, Governor Emmanuel Udo welcomed the PDP governor to his state, told them that their people do not make mistakes to elect them to represent them. Udom described the People Democratic Party governors as leaders with character and charisma. People Democratic Party leader, league advisor, Emmanuel, speaking on behalf of the People Democratic Party National Working Committee, NWC, said that PDP governors are making the party proud with their performance and in their respective states. Today, if there is any hope for democracy in Nigeria, it will come from the People Democratic Party governors because of their excellent performance in the state so far, he added. My people, so this is what is happening. People Democratic Party are making a pledge that it is time for them to get rid of, uh, you know, uh, get rid of APC because Nigerians are tired of APC and all their likes and everything that belongs to them. Nigerians are really tired and cannot wait any longer. And so as a result of that, they want to ensure that um, they do not continue anymore, you know. So this is what is happening. This is what is going on. Uh, PDP, APC, they are the same people. They are the same people who are 
you know uh I, for me i don't see any difference to be very candid i don't see any difference i don't see any difference pdp apc it's all the same thing to me honestly speaking whether pdp or apc is the same governors moving from one party to the other is it not it's the same people so whether you say pdp or apc it doesn't matter you see whatever whatever name they are called is just a name it's just a name it's just another name because the truth of the matter is the players remains the same so what has changed the same strategy the same everything so nothing has really changed nothing has really changed you see pdp apc we all have to you know we all have to be honest and we all have to say it as it is that these people do not really care if they do let us see the difference in the government if they do let us experience them don't just tell us that uh, uh, we are working let us see the work yes let's see it show it to us don't just say it to us say, show us that you are you're really working and you mean well for the people let's see it let's see it that's the problem they can't show it they can't so whether you like it or not something is seriously not right and we all know it something is not right this is what the youth came out for 2020 october to say enough is enough muhammad buhari enough is enough we need we need accountability in this government and guess what they were ready to they, they, they did not they were not just ready to kill they killed nigerian youth did everything they wanted to do all because they wanted their own their own say or their own will they never really cared and truly cared about nigerians it was all pointing to the fact that they are for themselves let's be very factual here let's be very honest if we don't stand up and defend what really belongs to us these people do they really care that's what one thing we should be asking ourselves do they really care do they really you see because we've come a long way you see we've come a long way and the way things are now if we don't if we don't uh, let our voices to be heard they are ready to push us down oh yes trust me they are ready to do everything humanly possible to put nigerians in a, in a, in a, in a, in a, in a sublime position but leave us a comment don't forget to like us share subscribe click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news god bless you don't forget you have a voice let it count have a lovely day bye for now